me, Dixie. Please hurry. She calls me Dicky. The same way Tasha used to pronounce your name. See a doc. See if there's something. It's, it's it's fine. It's fine. We we need to get to the bridge. It's time for first shift. Thanks, anyways. I know, sir, and I understand, but. You know as well as I that Federation hasn't had contact with the Minokan planet since the Sakuran coup a hundred years ago. To be exact, it was 97 years ago. Military operations that close to the border could be seen as a provocation. Captain, you have your orders and so do I. Get Demos to the Eloise system now. Walk around. Roger that. A fifth rep on all senior officers by 0630. I'd like to plan a morale day. Let's make it this Saturday. Gotcha. Let's go ahead and get our maintenance back up to date with the uh, shuttle crews. <laughs> Help me, Dixie, please hurry. Help me, Dickie, please hurry. Who is this? Ella Key Pharrell, please hurry. Father, no. Oh, wait, wait. Excuse me. Dick. Dick. Dick! Sleeping on duty, mister. Is that the sort of shit my predecessor left me with? Sir, someone's in trouble. You got that right. Number one, have Ensign Tannis report to the bridge. I we'll see it. if she can stay awake off duty. Ensign Tannis to the bridge. Mr. Dakin, you're relieved and confined to quarters. We'll discuss this later. Now get off my bridge. Yes, Captain. Okay, like I was saying, let's do a, uh, you know what, make it a safety stand down, full, and let's. Do all shuttles because if we're going to go off world, we have to make sure that uh, everybody's up to date. Uh, speaking up to date, I'm going to need shot records, immunizations, and everybody's MIC. Sir? Here we go. I'm here to relieve you. All right, listen up, people. Starfleet Operations has ordered us to the LOE system to join war games in progress. Isn't that where Planet Minoka is? We haven't been welcomed there for a hundred years. 97. Mr. Tathan, set course. Ensign Tannis, warp 7. Aye. Mr. Calhoun, arrange a series of battle drills. Aye, Captain. Mr. Grogo, ensure emergency preparedness of all decks. Aye, Captain. Mr. Dakin, I'm aware that you lost a daughter a few years ago, and most recently you had an unusual encounter with that, that thing on Epsilon Lyrae 4. Is there anything we No, can sir. It's not Tasha in my dreams. She was only three years old when her and her mother passed away two years back. This girl's Minokin, eight to 10 standard years old. Are you aware that we're heading to planet Minoka as we speak? No, sir. Why? We've not had dealings with them in 97 years or so. The little girl in her dreams, what's her name? Uh, Loki? Pharrell, I think. Is that her? We're going to die, Dakey. Sir, this might not make sense to you. 
But Aloki never got to experience the great things in life. She was never able to chase her dreams, so Captain, if we could just... I know, Dakin, and I sympathize. Sir, I'm not a temporal theoretician. Theoretician. And I can't say it, nor can I spell it. But there must be... It's ancient history. Something... Dead and gone. ...we can do. Sir, history only records that the family yacht burned up in the atmosphere, but presumably shot down by the Sakura. No bodies were... Complete immolation. ...were found in the wreckage. Sir, imagine if they have lived. Millions lost their lives by the brutal tyranny of the Sakura. Every world has its tyrannies. My own especially. They're not dead. And this isn't a dream. They're... I'm... I'm a conduit, and they're alive. Back there, years ago. Where were you, sir, when the, the whale sang the clouds away? Where were you when your Earth realized that they were going to live? I'm not Jim Kirk. I can't just call Starfleet up and say, hey, guys, I'd like to slingshot back in time to save the Minogue Royal House. Mind if I risk umpteen trillion credits worth of equipment and 180 lives? possibly change all of history for the worse? Hell, not even Kirk could do that. Millions of Minokan lives were lost in the Civil War and it's burned ever since. And all the dilithium was wasted on weapons of war as both sides lobbed bombs and missiles at one another. The Federation is not a business. And even if we did save millions of Minokan lives, billions more might die in some unforeseen consequence. And who would know? If time branches, we won't be asked when we return. Captain, as you know, violation of the temporal directive is a court-martial offense. The Demos just lost one captain to a truly foolish decision. We're not ready to lose another one. Well, it was nice being captain for a few weeks. I'll start the calculations. Beam them off at the last minute? Is that what you're thinking? Have either of you ever tried to transport the passengers off of a spacecraft that is crashing into the atmosphere in an uncontrolled re-entry? Come on, Eric. We'll figure something out. Let's go. Did you really come to die with us? No. The whales are going to sing today. I got a transportation enhancer. This should magnify all your signals and give you something to lock onto to beat me to safety. Now, everyone, hold on. I'm sorry I have to go, Loki. But I want you to enjoy the great things of life. I want you to chase your dreams. I want you to be greater than great. I want you to be excellent. OK? Bring me back.
back home, which is where we should get. Captain the bridge. Bridge here. Mr. Duffy, take us back to when and where we belong. Yes, Captain. Duffy out. I have my orders, and so do you. Get Demos to Minoka for the coronation. Walk her out. Roger that. Sir, I'm still me, and I remember both timelines. The assassination, subsequent civil war, and 97 years of peace and tranquility. Captain here. Captain Harper, please report to the bridge, sir. Let's go. Your Majesty. Your Majesty. Your Majesties? I'll overlook you missing my coronation if you would be so kind as to explain yourselves to the royal grandmother. I chased all my dreams that came, and I've been most excellent. <laughs>